will it stand? We've put some liquid in here. Doesn't fall. So with the gun in, put it down. But will it break? So I'm gonna hold it out here. Hey guys, JC from Active with another foam cannon design prototype update. Right here, we have our latest update from the factory and I wanna share with you how it's going. How will we start with a little design? The color is the, is the obvious update from the last one. We had, uh, we had a prototype bottle that was sort of a, kind of an ugly yellow orange color. It is now, it will be much closer to this, which is a smoky gray. The The logos are on here as well. We've got the measurements along the, the back side here. One other feature, the nozzle, I'll bring it to the mic here. It uh, is a very satisfying clicking sound when you, when you rotate from, you know, 90, zero degrees, whatever on the fan adjustment. But yeah, in general, everything feels a little bit more finished, a little bit more you know, resolved. It's feeling like a very nice engineered product. As well, the, the stainless steel, so our cast stainless steel component here, you know, it's, it's looking quite sharp. And it's, as we'll discuss later, functioning very well. We had a lot of nice feedback along the way. I think that we're just about there. I think we've 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 satisfied a lot of everything you're looking for. Obviously, the the quality of foam was always number one. Uh, you'll see later. Somebody had a suggestion that we could sell individual bottles with caps. Yeah, we think that's a great idea. So we'll be having those available in the parts store as well as for warranty issues. In case you don't know, we'll be opening a parts store very soon. Look for the updates. Would also like to say thank you to I'm Josh V, who made a very nice video after my last video. That was very flattering, so thank you. It was a very sweet surprise. Without further ado, let's see how this performs. We'll be testing it uh, with a couple different units and testing it against the MJJC and the MTM model. So what we have is Active 2.3 as our base unit with the 1.45 orifice, as well as the Active 2.3, we'll also be testing it with the Active 2.0 using the 1.25 orifice, running a 10 to 1 chemical mix in each of the foam cannons. Let's go! <laughs> So as you can see, I think we've achieved what we set out to do with that creating that really nice thick uh, shaving cream foam. Goes on thick, comes off very nice. You guys be the judge. Let us know your opinions as as always, how we're doing and how it compares with, with your own at home. A few other issues to, to check. Will it stand? We've put some liquid in here, you know, doesn't fall. So with the gun in, Put it down, everything's still nice and stable. I think it all looks quite well together, fitting in again with the, with the product language that we've begun. But will it break? So I'm gonna hold it out here, and we're just gonna put it back over here. It's the only one we have, so we'll wait for uh, Keeves to, uh, to give us his, 
is demolition test. So this will be sold independently, but as well, we will be selling it with a full accessory kit as well. So in the kit, you'll have the foam cannon, you'll have the gun with the newly improved mechanism, just addressing some feedback that we got. So I think you'll all be happy with that. We'll go through that in another video. And the wand, the new angle extension wand, as well as a hose, 50 foot hose. I don't have one here. I'll show it to you next time. As soon as we get all the accessories in, we'll do a deep dive on all those and post another video going through each item for you. So stay tuned for that. As always, like and subscribe. Leave us some comments. It's always helpful. Thank you very much. Talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.